back here. You're not even hidden. Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. <laughs> I thought you said you wasn't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's two Michael Townleys living in LS. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut up, yeah, or I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta, about the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda. Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Woo! Punch, ah! I knew it. Ah! Don't you ever not tell me things I want to know. Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard. Get out here. We're going to Los Santos. Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money and tidy my shit up. Let's go, Wade, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. Gay. I'm joking. Oh, you can suck me off. Well, still gay. Are we gonna stop for ice cream? No. Um, so, so, so we're headed to Los Santos soon? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Or oh, stop. what's your stop? Ice cream? If you say ice cream one more time, I am gonna oh. fucking great school. We taking this one? Get in! Alright. I'm messing with you. Get in the car. Oh, nah, bro, get in the car. Come on, I got a babe. Where are your people at in Los Damn. Santos? Can you check my cousin there, Floyd? He's bumped in with his girlfriend in some place called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's the stop? Family's important, Wade. It's not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, ow! Employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, uh, I got my big eye, but where are we stopping on the way? Cause you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sakes, another chapter of the lost descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn, maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts for these pricks. There you go. Something all the could be proud of. Whatever they said about him snitching, man, that was bullshit. Billy would have never let this shit go down right here. One thing you would see was taking down a whole chapter. Ridiculous. Let's take a ride. See what kind of shape you have to play in.
Nothing, you useless pricks! You're worse than the last bunch of cocks! Oh shit, it's not... Get out of town, you assholes! Oh shit! You'll fucking die here! Come on! Put him in the ground, people! Time to hit the road, Wadey! Los Santos, here we come! That go okay? I heard about the banging and screaming, but then not knocking that guy. Yeah, it went good, Wade. We don't have to think about the loss no more. Let's go find my old buddy. This Michael Cowboy guy must have pissed you off real bad for you to want to find him so much. He didn't piss me off. The guys that killed him, the federal government, they pissed me off. But if he's dead, who's this? Now you're starting to grasp the pertinent questions. Who is this guy using my dead friend's tired ass movie quotes? With my dead friend's alias? And my dead friend's family? In a house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions? Wow, that's a real mind huh? I'll show you a fucking mind fuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye! It's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean anything by that, P! Trevor! Move up your eye hole, fucker! Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? Oh, no. I'm about ready to turn you into roadkill! Ah, please, don't turn me into anything! I just want to be away! Are we nearly there yet? No way! Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all! Can you tell me a story? No way! Let's play a game then! You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first! I'm nanotechnology. What? Uh, you're what? You're what? Ooh! Damn it! I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, hey, hey! How about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tr... Tr... Uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Kind of weird. <laughs> it was weird. Ben Andreas. Best part of the state. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life. It's been nearly ten years, which you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You motherfucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Floyd ain't around here. What are you doing? Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? It's this Fuji Beach where he's staying. Will you tell me the story about that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? Right, 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 right. So, this kid, he could fly planes. So, he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe, just maybe, drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable and grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him into a deep pit of doubt and despair. And just then, just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. Nish Michelle. A lady troll? Ugh, he had tits like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny <laughs> name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. You know what? 
little Trisha did rob people, and little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club, and they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits, even bigger than his real troll tits, so she could make more money stripping. Maybe a little on the side without call work, but... Oh, oh, we're near Floyd's house. I've seen it on the i find maps. I'll give you directions. Now, he's going. Don't forget to like and favorite this video and leave a comment down below.